Hey, hey, I'm Bryce Johnson with today's video devotional. We call it Unpack This. It's a quick thought about sports, faith, and life. And I got to talk about Game 3. Last night in the NBA Finals, the Toronto Raptors took a 2-1 series lead, but it really was a great game. Now, the Warriors were playing undermanned, but how about that performance by Steph Curry? 47 points. And the problem, though, for the Warriors is the whole night, they just could never get over the hump because the Raptors had an answer to every mini run that the Warriors went on, every big three that the Warriors hit. On the other end, the Raptors had a response. So maybe Andre Iguodala would hit a big shot, but then the Raptors would come back, respond, and Van Vliet would hit a three. Danny Green, countless threes all night was an answer, especially in that third quarter, to, to, to what the Warriors were doing. And, and maybe even the Warriors would go on a fast break and it looked like they were going to have an easy layup. And then out of nowhere, Serge Ibaka or Serge Ablaka got the block and it was a big uh, defensive stopper last night in the game. And so all of this reminds me of how in life we, we all deal with different uh, attacks from the opponent. We, we deal with, with kind of runs that are, that are up against us. And so we have to decide how are we going to respond what is the answer when all of a sudden stress comes our way, worry comes our way, fear comes our way, doubt, loneliness? Will we respond with hope, joy, peace, faith, and, and trust, and, and in those moments not allow the, 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 uh, the opponent to take over, to take the lead from us? We, we should be, as followers of Jesus, living in victory. And, and continue to, to, to keep the lead with that kind of mentality to, to operate with, with faith and, and hope and joy. And, and the other kind of thought with this, too, is this idea when we, when we do live with hope and joy and really are following Jesus, people are going to want to know what's different about us. And, and so the Bible says, but in your hearts, revere Christ as Lord. Always be prepared to give an answer to everyone who asks you to give the reason for the hope that you have. So ultimately, the, the answer is, is Jesus. So when, when stress and worry come our way, the answer is Jesus. And he provides us the hope, the joy, the peace that we need. And so he says, I am the way, the truth, and the life. So he's the answer and he's the ultimate response that we need to all of life's questions and to all the daily runs and attacks that come our way. I'm Bryce Johnson and you can unpack that.